Sometimes you get so busy helping others You forget to give a care about you Wellness in the workplace applies even when you're working from home. In this episode of Alvo Cardo, we're talking to Kaylin White from VIP Desk Connect about her self-care wins and struggles while working remote. There may or may not be a very cute dog in this episode, so be ready. Hi, I am Kaylin White. I work at VIP Desk Connect. I'm excited to share with you some of my self-care wellness wins and struggles. I have been working remotely for five years now and love it. I like to start my day right. I begin my day every work day uh, working out and walk my dog, which is my favorite thing to do. And while I'm walking, I channel my mind, clear my mind, start my day right. If I'm not walking my dog, I do uh, my elliptical, start my day with movement. I think that that brings a sense of sort of order to my day and allows me to sort of wake up in this great mind frame. I think that that's a really important uh, win uh, for working at home and and self-care. And um, I also start my day with affirmations. These are just basic affirmations, one that I really do every day. It's just basically whatever I'm maybe struggling with at the time. Uh, It could be, you know, just things that I need to work on and uh, important things that I want to help channel into my life. And a big glass of water. (laughs) And then coffee. Lots of coffee. Some of my struggles, I'd say, would be turning it off. I think that's every struggle for a remote team or a a virtual uh, agent. I have learned over the last five years when to walk away, start to feel it in my shoulders if I'm sitting too long. I try to get up as much as I can to move around, but not just to move around. I want to engage my brain in something completely different to sort of unplug away from a screen, whether that's looking out the window, going outside, breathing fresh air, playing with my dog, speaking with my husband, whatever it may be, I make sure that I do it now because I felt the strain and the stress when I don't. Also making sure to turn it off on the weekends or whenever you really truly do have a break. It's so easy to open the computer and sit on the couch and get some work done, but really that takes away from the balance. You do need to stop and say to yourself, no, I'm going to go and take a bath and read my book and, you know, go outside, you know? Um, So I think it's really, really important to turn it off. That's one of my ongoing challenges, something I feel I'm doing a lot better at in life. Um, And I'm actually seeing results in my workflow. No matter how busy you may get, uh, it'll be there for you when you get back. Trust me. (laughs) 